Hi everyone, I'm Kieran Dalton and welcome to the Kieran Dalton channel on YouTube. It's a, it's a pretty good day. Um, I finally had something positive to say about Rugby Union Australia. Uh, a lot of people have been critical of them lately and they kind of deserved it. But uh, today, my fifth favourite sporting team, the Penrith Emus, has come out of the grave and they're back. They're back for the 2020 Shoot Shield competition. Uh -huh. Say so good. Um, there are uh, stadiums walking distance from my parents' house, <coughs> so I used to go there a lot. Uh, I, moved, I, my, I still live in Penrith, but I'm not walking distance now. So I'm still going to go to the games. I won't be able to drink now because I have to drive. Let's just hope their performances get better. Um, this is a team that for three or four weeks did not score one point. Again, I, I kind of think Rugby Union Australia should take some of the blame. Uh, I have other videos on the topic, but it's just good to have him back. Hopefully, <coughs> I'm not expecting him to win the cup. I'm not even expecting him to win the finals. I'm expecting him to get the wooden spoon again, but I'm hoping that they win a couple of games and prove to Rugby Union that they deserve to be in the comp. And now, Rugby, League sh uh, Rugby Union should help them by like giving them players, like maybe... Uh, well, you can give them current Wallabies because there's no competition. So maybe like throw some money at like a a Wallaby or fringe Wallaby player and get them to play at the club. Uh, <coughs> the more people, the more they win, the more people will watch them. And <coughs> a lot of people say rugby league, Pembroke is a rugby league town, and and they're right. But I think it's big enough for two codes, very similar codes. Uh, they have to share rope with GWS Giants as well. Who's getting momentum? They're getting more supporters. Uh, don't believe the haters, aka uh, Richmond Tiger supporters. Uh, they have nothing but negativity to say. Um, but yeah, I think Penrith would embrace both teams if they go well. Uh, just don't play the two game like don't play Panther games and Penrith Amy games at the same time. That way, people can watch both. Uh, it's easily done, or NRL and uh, ARU have to do is talk, which they probably won't because they're fierce rivals. But if they like, if they're smart, they should do that. Uh, but you know, at least with KO, uh, which is like Netflix for sport, I uh, I can watch the I can watch the rugby league on delay. Um, rugby Union isn't on. Foxtel, I don't think. Well, that was one of the things Raylene Castle stuffed up. And Shoot Shield, I don't think ever was on Robbie. I don't know how Foxtel, I think that was always a uh, ABC thing. But anyway, uh, and if NRL don't want to tell the AMUs or ARU, Rugby Union Australia, when the Panthers are playing, just put all the AMU games at 2 o'clock on a Saturday or Sunday. Penrith never get that time slot. It's mainly like a camera radius time slot in Auckland Warriors. But yeah, uh, now they're back. Hopefully they play at the Nepean Rugby Park. It's, it's a great park. It's small, which is a good size. You don't want them to play at a stadium too big because they won't fill it up. And bring back the emu burger, which not made out of real emus. It's like a, uh, a rissole. Uh, I think there's onions on it and a crap load of uh, gravy. Uh, I go to a lot of sporting grand, uh, events. I think Australian Open has the best food, yeah, but the Amy Burger is definitely up there. Uh, I think I said this in another video, but I'm going to say Amy Burger is number one, just so there's a bit more positivity positivity in Rugby Union Australia. But, you know, Amy's are back, so there's heaps. So it's pretty good. Uh, how long live the Pembroke Emus? Uh, to be fair, Rugby Union said they will come back, and for a while there, I was waiting on the street corner for them to come back like Fry's Dog and Futurama. Uh, there's a reference of Futurama, look it up, it's heartbreaking. But um, I might also say that on another video. Uh, um, this is almost like a repeat, I'm paraphrasing my own self, but I'm just happy to have them back. Uh, probably won't be able to watch them live because of COVID-19. Uh, that was me sticking the finger up to disease, not, not the rules. 
where you can't get a sporting runs. I agree with that. Um, yeah, I'm looking forward to them for the emus. Where they're back. Now we just got to save the real emus in the ADR site. Uh, look that up. There, there's a bushland in Pamrith. It's the only place in Sydney where, where there's wild emus and to try to build houses there and send the emus to an emu farm. But I won't get into that. That's a negative. This video, I want to be positive, which it is. Uh, thank you, Rabbit Uni Australia. You're going, it's the best thing you've done in a while. I think firing Robbie Deans, which you never should have been hired, and now this. They're the best things you've done. All right. Uh, Robbie Deans was a Wallaby coach. He was from New Zealand, so you never put our fiercest rival in charge of our team. Uh, Australian coach, uh, Australian team should always have Australian coach. And Robbie Deans did this thing where if you weren't playing in Australia, you couldn't play for the Wallaby. So all these good players like Matt Gitto, uh he's the only one I can think of, but Matt Gitto, who still was in form and had a lot to give, was playing in England because he wanted a bit more money at the end of his career, which is fair enough. And he missed out on the Wallaby World Cup for that, uh, on the Rugby Union World Cup because of that. So, But anyway... Amy's are back. Uh, I'm hoping for two wins this year. Um, I know that sounds like me being a prick to them, but, you know, we've got to be realistic. I don't want to be one of these supporters who think my team's going to win the comp, and when the team doesn't win the comp, they just blame everyone in the club. No, I'm uh, hoping for two wins. Uh, come on, go you emus. Uh, it's going to be good. Uh, what do you really need? Yeah, so Rugby Union Australia, get a half. Get I get a half. Um, I don't know what halves you can get, but there's got to be a good one out there somewhere. And just send them to the emus. Just pay them whatever you can. There's no. There's probably a few players who were meant to play in England, but are now back in Australia because of COVID-19. Um, get them to play for the emus. Anyway, that's that's my video. Um, pretty good, pretty happy. Uh, viva la vie. Uh, go to emus. Um, so this is my channel. Uh, I talk all type of things, sport, uh, video games, just my opinion. Uh, please subscribe, press, please press the like button. Uh, please tell your friends. Look up my other videos about rugby union. I think I've got three and I've got a few about rugby league and I'm going to do other sports soon so thank you thanks for watching Kieran Dalton